started this journey right here at the lake. I came across the lake, then I took this turn and came through the country all the way over back to Highway 280 and then into the Age of Americas. Hello everyone. Uh, about a year ago, Kathy and I did a video of Sumter County covering places in Sumter County. Uh, but we didn't cover everything. Sumter County is a pretty large county. Recently I we rode down I rode down uh, Lamar Road from Lake Blackshear back into Americas, Georgia. And this is a video of that that ride. You'll get to see what uh, countryside looks like. Hope you enjoy the video. If you do uh, give us a thumbs up. If uh, you have subscribed to our channel already, we give you a thank you. Uh, you're very, very special people to us. Uh, if you haven't subscribed and like travel videos, uh, we ask that you subscribe to our channel. We ask that you leave us a comment down in the video description section. Uh, if you uh, have a question or if there's a comment you'd like to make, Share this video with someone that you know that might like uh, travel videos. And Kathy and I wish that each and every one of you just have a very, very blessed day. Hello everyone. Uh, this is Hubert from Traveling with Hubert. We are about to cross Lake Blackshear and go into Sumter County. This is what you'll see if you're heading west on US 280. You see some construction going on. They're four-laning this uh, road, at least to the to, to here anyway. This is the old bridge. New bridges on the left. quite bumpy this old bridge there you see the sign that says Sumter County and that's what the subject of this video is about it's about a part of Sumter County that we haven't videoed yet there's a storage shed and a, a fitness place back on the left and a RV park on the left you're gonna see lots of pecan trees These uh, orchards are old. They've been here for as long as I've been coming to this area. Up at the center section, we're going to go to the right and travel down Lamar Road. You may, <clears throat> if you check out some of our other Americas videos, uh, we talk about Lamar Road in Americas, Georgia. This is that road that comes out through the country. The gray building on the left used to be a little convenience store called Fat Boys. Seems to have closed up. This, this particular orchard is Lyle Farms. Uh, see some of their business there, Lyle Farms, yes. The 
storage shed up here on the right. And there's the sign that says Lyle Farms. One of the things you're going to see in this video is a lot of open fields. Pretty good sized fields. This is rural Georgia for those of you that live in town. All this open spaces may make you a little nervous, but we kind of like it. There's an irrigation system. Some more Lyle Farms equipment on the, on the right. can't really tell what that crop is. A little community back on the left. Spring Creek uh, Tavern right there on the right. These houses on the left, their property backs up to a slough up off the, the lake. things you see a lot in Georgia, rural Georgia, are mobile homes. And here you can see uh, the large open areas that I was talking about. Kathy's not with me today. She had uh, another obligation. She wanted to come, but sometimes our schedules don't mesh up. So, hopefully she'll be in the next video. I miss her when she's not here. If you see a little bug crawling in front of the video, those are gnats. They can be quite pesky at times. Tractor alert, tractor alert. See some farm buildings up here. have a little church up here. I think this is Spring Creek Baptist Church. It's a cute little church. I 
I'll give some information about Sumter County along in the video. Some's probably already going to be there. Some of the fields are fallow. That just simply means they haven't been cultivated recently. The, on the right is a cornfield. Corn's looking really good and green. bridge over a little creek and for those of you that don't live out in the country and you go down to the grocery store I'm not saying this is where the veggies come from but a lot of products you may use, uh, this is where they have their star. Another cornfield on the right. Nice looking stand of corn too. Up here on the left is a nice farmhouse, some farm buildings, with a white fence around it. It's kind of nice. That was um, State Road 195 that we just crossed. A little fire station back there with some firefighting equipment in it. Also see a lot of pine trees. We we grow a lot of pine trees. So if you get anything that's made from pine, there may be a possibility that it came from here. I don't think the timber industry here is as vibrant as it once was. Maybe. There are other agricultural products now that The farmers rely on a whole lot more than they do the, the trees. And when I started the video, there wasn't any little spots on the windshield, but we're in the country, and when you're in the country, you have bugs. And when you have bugs, you have bug spots on your windshield.
another field of corn. Uh, that one looks like it was planted later than the others I've been showing you. But again, it still looks like a nice, healthy growth of field of corn. building on the left at one time was a business but I think it is now closed like a lot of places in, in South Georgia middle Georgia businesses come and businesses go coming up on the end of this particular section of Lamar Road at one time it, at this intersection it went straight across and you can see that and it ran into US 280 some old trees You can see what I was talking about earlier about Lamar Road going straight at this intersection. Um, and what they did, District Line Road came in to this road and then it went st like straight ahead and then it formed a Y with um, Highway 280. And several years ago they came in and extended District Line Road over to the 280 and close down that 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 intersection up ahead of us so if I had come back uh, on highway 280 This is where I would have passed this particular intersection. Williams Print Shop, or uh, Office Equipment Company, not, excuse me, not Print Shop, Office Equipment Company. This is where Lamar Road would have come in to Highway 280. So I'm assuming that this is 
is part of Lamar Road as we head toward uh, Americas. Here's William Ro Williams Road Church. We did a video of churches, but that video has been lost to, to me. Folks, we have made it to the edge of America, Georgia. Uh -oh. So I will end this video here. Hope you enjoyed our little trip through the country.